So, as a dungeon master, you want to run deep in flowing plot at every corner, at every quest. You want uh, to have mystery, you want to have depth, you want to have story that flows and branches and is complex and uh, is uh, natural and not at all over-contrived. Yet, uh, preparation seemingly for such a task is, frankly, ridiculous. Yet, that's not the case, necessarily. We can do this and we can have only but one second of preparation per such an undertaking, like a quest or a piece of campaign. How is this possible? We use tables. But uh, wouldn't it be soulless to just roll something like a wild magic table but for quests and pick one of the pre-made hundred results or something like that? Wouldn't that be random and stupid and wacky? Well, perhaps, perhaps not, but that's not what we're gonna do. We're gonna use complex tables. And we're not gonna use pre-made results. We're going to use mental objects, sort of notes that will remind you what you can develop from that single piece of information within a chain. How does this work? Well, let's look at one of my tables, this 4D100 mystery generator. It has two tables of D100 results, and each table is rolled twice. We get these uh, mental objects and, well, let's see an example. An emperor's uh, family has fallen under an affliction, yet uh, the emperor has gotten a vision or a stroke of inspiration that uh, it's uh, his cousins that are plotting something occult and weird against the whole empire for their own ends. So now the emperor needs a skilled set of hands to help uh, resolve this tragic uh, situation which uh, the citizens of the empire have found themselves in. But uh, who is the source of the emperor's information? Is that being benevolent or something else? Or is the emperor simply going mad and imagining things? Well, uh, this example, you can see on this table how it was rolled and uh, if you want this and many more tables for an example on how you can make them, which already uh, was explained by this point, but um, take as many examples as you like, because uh, I have plenty and they're free and they're all there for you. Um, just uh, go to the uh, section in the description labeled treasure, you'll find a link, you'll find uh, dozens and dozens of these tables, like uh, folk custom generator or complex uh, conversation creation or city landscape points of interest or auto-magical incantations or procedural pantheon and such things. They're all free to use, you can even show them off on your own channel, in your own games that you record for YouTube if you want, and... Well, ask me anything, I reply to all comments and we'll see you through this. Welcome to the DM table, I'm M, and this was One Minute Dungeons & Dragons. Well, I didn't get it under a minute. Sorry.